Creative nonfiction comes in different forms of writing. It employs literary techniques to achieve creativity. It seeks closer to the truth. Today, we will discover the different forms you can use to convey your ideas and experiences. Hi learners! This is Mom Eva and welcome to Creative Nonfiction. At the end of today's discussion, you are expected to recognize the different forms of creative nonfiction and familiarize and appreciate the different examples of the forms of creative nonfiction. Creative nonfiction illustrates creativity in weaving factual details together. Writing creative nonfiction comes in different forms. In the previous lesson, we tackled about the elements of creative nonfiction. In today's class, we will discuss its forms and examples. Let us now get ready for today's discussion. Have fun! What can you say about the pictures? Have you ever seen or read any of them? Here are some jumbled letters. All you have to do is to arrange the letters to identify the word being described. How well did you do in our activity? Are those terms familiar to you? Here are the forms of creative nonfiction. Autobiography is a story of a person's life in a specific moment in time that is told by the person himself or herself. It can be in a form of journals, diaries, letters, or memoirs. Here is an example of an autobiography. A reportage or reportage is also called a literary journalism. It is a precise, well-researched report of which a reporter follows a topic, subject, or theme for a long period of time and then provides a personal angle on it. Here is an example of a literary journalism. Personal narratives are taken from real-life situations where the writer depicts vividly the event, incident, or experience. Here is an example of a personal narrative. A travelogue embraces the personal accounts of a writer on travel as he or she evaluates the food, hotels, restaurants, and best sites to visit. Here is an example of a travelogue. Reflection essay examines a writer's perspective in life by allowing the author to introspect and ponder back if such situation created an impact on his or her life. Here is an example of a reflection essay. Blogs belong to social networking service where it portrays an online discussion among writers as they engage in an informal diary method of presenting their stories. Here is an example of a blog. Testimonial consists of a person's written or spoken statement on a product or experience. It can also be seen as a historical biography. Here is an example of a testimonial. It's fun time! Let's have the TikTok challenge. Compose a song and create TikTok dance steps out of the topic we just discussed. Let's begin! Are you done with our challenge? Upload it on TikTok, tag me, and don't forget to use the hashtag forms of CNF and hashtag creative nonfiction. What are the different forms of creative nonfiction? How did you find them? Why is it important to learn these forms? Let us continue to enjoy doing the remaining tasks as evidence of your learning. Now let's check your paper. How well did you do in our assessment? Very good! Writing is indeed a great way to impart a piece of it to the world. Through writing, you can share your highs and lows, defeats and successes, or even your brokenness and how it made you whole. There are different forms of creative nonfiction. You choose. I hope you learned something today. This is Mom Eva for Creative Nonfiction.